I mean, to be honest, you got some nice carpeting in here. Now, could I by any chance get the heck out of here? Nice Coca-Cola bottle. Can I have one of these? No, duh. Got three sticks of dynamite. Seems to have made some modifications. Should probably go ahead and take the pliers since I don't have mine. Why sleep at home when you can sleep in a ca Yeah, yeah, wh why would you? I, I mean, it's, it's just, oh, thank goodness. Lee Enfield, um, which I believe in is an M1, but I'm not sure. Um, thank goodness I have, I still can't aim. Am I, am I scared I'm gonna shoot the wall? Oh my goodness, okay. Focus, 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 focus. I'm really not liking this. Alright, let's continue on. Let me just make sure I got everything. Yep, yep. Okay, just as a, a, a little bit of a word of advice for uh, anybody intending to do this. There might be something living in that cave. Two there might be a problem with the cave in the sense that it might collapse. And three, there might be something even worse that I can't bother to think of. And I'm not trying to be a crazy person here, but I would never sleep in a cave even if it was thundering and lightning outside and there was a tornado. I most certainly wouldn't do it just because it's a fear of mine that something's gonna happen. Well, no, not that I wasn't... Okay, I wouldn't say a fear. I would more go on the verge of... It is not something that I would do just because I don't trust the, the cave. Now, if it was a small indentation in a rock, a mountain, rather, I'd be fine with that, but... Anyway, how about we go ahead and continue our wonderful journey? Yay! Gonna be great. Uh -huh. Go down a dark path. Uh, I can get down here. Can I not? Do I need to go back this way? I need to go back this way. What? No! 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 Ah! Oh, thank goodness. Okay, phew! Well, you know what? You... Alright, hold on. I got a word about this. If I was able to push a ramp and it just magically falls into place, there's no way I'm gonna be in that cave ever again, I'm just saying. Because if there's some spoopy doopy stuff going on, I'm not gonna be around. <sighs> okay, let me reposition again real quick, and I will get on with getting terrified. Why is my heart beating just a second ago? Ice seemed to take over this place like mold. That wall wasn't there earlier. How was he going to get out of here? Are you kidding me? You... you... Oh, so I have to go this way. That's not a little weird at all. A little bit unexpected, don't you think? 
Well, that's just great. That means I have to go the opposite way, which means me having to go back, which means me possibly running into the thing, which also means me also might dying. So, me don't want to die, me want to survive, me want to find out who murdered who, and me want to go back to home and have hot chocolate on bed, or by fire, and read newspaper, and watch TV. Either way, I don't want to be in this cave, okay? I'm just saying. Let me go ahead and get ready to go traverse the deep, dark cave. Which I unfortunately have to go traverse the deep, dark, spoopy doopy cave. Oop. Sorry. Oh, wait. Huh? Hold up. Hold on a minute. I fell down a one way. I know how. Oh wait. Now run like crazy. That didn't work. Really? <sighs> the ice, oddly, did not budge despite the powerful fiery blast. Something was definitely rotten in this place. Well, you know for a fact that there's something spoopy doopy going on if the thick ice isn't broken by an explosion. So I guess we gotta go back around. Gotta go this way then. Carl suddenly felt observed. He was worried about a presence around him. Great! I'm so excited! I gonna meet somebody? Oh, <gasps> Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Go away. <laughs> How dare you scare me like that? My goodness. Okay, so I'm back at I'm back at the spot here. A hall. Oh. Um did I not want to do that? I, I may or may not have stood just a, a tad bit close. 
Yeah, let me just use some killers real quick because that... If I do get attacked by a doggone demon wolf, I want to be prepared. Oh, that's great. That's, that's just great. No stone can withstand a force of dynamite. Ha. Ah. True, but also, uh... What? Okay. Um... I think that there's gonna be a pretty big jump scare on the other side of this wall. Or other side of this hill. So, if I scream... Just know that that's probably what it was. So, just, just putting that out there. Okay, let's, let's, let's go ahead and do this. that I am freaking out right now cuz I'm pretty sure I just heard something Okay, I'm, I'm gonna just head back to the car. And I'm gonna hope with a big hope Last phantom, lost in solitude up until now, joined the others in the forest's darkness, free at last to enjoy an eternal, well-deserved slumber. Carl was only beginning to understand the horror which had struck this village. He understood that the dead were piling up and that he couldn't help them by himself. The road was clear for him. He needed to push further north and fast to find help. Stop with the stinking eye indicator, it's tripping me off. Ugh. Man, I don't like this at all. Stop with the loading screens too because now it's really tripping me off because I don't know what's going to pop up. I'm not liking any of the mo noises. The, the noises.
Another diary. Carl felt like someone was trying to communicate with him. Or was it simply the result of happenstance? The beast has outwitted me. It is aware that I know all of its weaknesses. It is aware of my strength. Carl wondered how long he would have to endure this skin-stinging cold. It is the predator become prey. Um, there's some of the unknown forces. I'll, I'll read this later. I gotta get some wood or something, because I'm really close to dead. This hunt was never ending. Carl hoped that the hunter had finally triumphed over the beast. Really? Because I'm running on fumes with warmth. Carl had found what he was looking for. He needed to get back on the road. Wait, are you, what if... Hold up. You said that I needed to get back on the road. I'm sorry about that, but I'm not going to Cold gonna be able to do turned so. into pain. Carl needed to fight in some place warm. I'll probably die actually. Save here, please. Options. I cannot save. But I am literally about to die. Carl reckoned that the place was still inhabited less than 24 hours ago. Are you kidding me? His detective sense tingled, revealing to him, or was it the strong smell of wilderness in the air, that there were most likely two men. Oh my gosh, you've got to be kidding me. I am literally about to die. Um, consumables. How about that I just go ahead and take a smoke? Uh, it's fine. It's all hunky dory. It's fine. Just toss that right over there. It's fine. Consumables, um, no equipment. Can I drop any of this? Uh, I'll throw out steak. Two blankets. Ah, oh, come on, um... There were doubtless two people here, Carl reckoned. Stop reckoning, just throw away the steak. Mmm, what else can I get rid of? Um... The door was unlocked. Carl felt kind of disappointed that he wouldn't have to solve the mystery of that padlock. 
Okay, 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 okay. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. That was too close. Two blankets. There were doubtless two people here, Carl reckoned. So I'll probably be needing that when something tries to come and eat me. The jacket was still soaking wet. The poor man had, surely unwillingly, had a taste of the pond's water not too long ago. According to the pay stub, that poor man was Alexandre Blais. That isn't ominous at all. That, in fact, it looks fine. It looks fine. It, there's nothing wrong with, it's fine. It's, it's just a little bit of blue air that showed up suddenly. It, it's fine. Pierre, I just wanted to remind you that there are rules, rules that are meant to be followed, whether you like it or not. I hear that you've been poaching a lot lately. That you don't even care about being discreet anymore. Heck, I don't even have a chance to pretend I don't see you these days. If I continue to turn a blind eye on this, what will people say? You've gone too far this time, buddy. I'll have to fire you. Or have to find you. I'll have to fine you, Wilfred. That is probably the uh, what's it called? Um, the bar? No, not the bartender. Um, the sheriff. There should be a rifle hanging there. Its owner may not be very far. <laughs> 